Hello and welcome to Zazu Salon and Spa. My name is Bruce and I am filming or interviewing Kimberly Turmel from Zazu. Kimberly was a finalist in the texture category for Contessa 2014. Contessa is the Academy Awards of our industry. It's um, a small percentage of hairdressers get to this category. She was a finalist and semi-finalist and finalist. She went to the big party in Toronto. She was in the top five of Canada, which is really, really impressive. I just want to say congratulations. Thank That's you. so cool. Um, what did you think of Contessa this year? What do you, um, what was your challenges? What did you, what did you find the biggest challenge? Well, I entered the texture competition and I guess the trickiest part of that for me was um, just, it was basically, came down to doing updos, which is not really my favorite part about doing hair, but somehow I wrote myself into it. So it was a good challenge for me. It made me, um, you know, kind of step up to the plate to do something different. And I think it went really well. Yeah, I think it did really well. Too. Yeah, it just made nice. me push myself, I guess. And it's always good. I mean, I think I mean, it's one thing I always like about Contessa is it pushes yourself into your out of your box and into comfort zones that you're not super comfortable totally. with. Totally. So yeah. it's really good. Yeah. Um, what did you love most about it? What was your favorite part of Contessa? Well, I guess just the fact that it pushes you outside of your creative boundaries and really makes you, um, you know, try to be like the best stylist you can be. Like it, um, you know, it makes you, you get to do things that you would never get to do on a day-to-day -day basis. So um, you really get to push your creative boundaries and see how far you can take your skill and your craft. Yeah, which is really true. It's hard work. Yeah. Definitely hard work. And what did you like most about Toronto? Like, what did you like most about the gala evening, where there's the top elite hairdressers of North America, for sure Canada? Yeah, um, I just love talking to everybody and like hearing everyone's story of how they got there and um, just like, you know, how many times people have made it to the finals but have never won or maybe like this was their first yeah. year and, yeah. and they won or whatever, just hearing everyone's story and it was just really inspiring and, um, you know, talking to like the big wigs in the industry and just hearing like how nice and humble they were and yeah. I don't know, it was just neat to to meet all those people, yeah. I guess. It's pretty amazing. It feels pretty special, doesn't it? You feel like, wow, I'm at the I'm in the big the big game now. I'm here yeah. playing with the big people. Yeah, it felt like yeah. like definitely like it was like the VIPs of the yeah. industry or something. Very I cool. Know. Very yeah. proud of you. And finally what um, for anybody that has never done Contessa before, what could, advice could you give them? What could you say to them? To make sure you win or got to a finalist or the podium, the winning category, what, what, um, what well, you say? Well, for sure, dedication. Um, you have to be 100% in. If you kind of, you know, get lazy at any point, there's just no point in doing it. Um, it's very hard work, but it's totally rewarding, especially when you get recognized for it. I mean, it's either way, if you make it to semifinals or not, it's still worth it. Um, because, you know, it's kind of made you that much of a better stylist just for trying, I think. Um, but, yeah, you have to be prepared to work hard and just, yeah, be as creative as you can. Yeah. And that concludes our interview. And I would agree with Kim that getting to the finalist position to me is, a, is, a, is like winning because that, that is a tremendous amount of work and it is a feat getting to that position. So... Um, my congratulations to you. Thank you. And I hope you continue to do it because you're very talented and you keep growing and you keep uh, mm -hmm. growing professionally and personally. And it's really nice to see you. Thanks. Congratulations. Thank you. All the best. <laughs> Thank you.